two minutes to help you get going faster in the morning. Getting up and going is the hardest part of any morning routine. By the end of this video, you will have three different ways to help you motivate yourself to get going in the morning. Hi, I'm Beth with Sheets and Systems, and I've helped hundreds of educators organize their digital lives through my digital checklists. Um, and I decided that it was time to start sharing my tips, tricks, and products with the world of how to live a simpler and more organized life. I know, I know, sleep is good and your bed is comfortable. As a girl who loves a nap myself, I understand. Um, getting up and getting going in the morning, having your feet actually hit the floor is the hardest part of any morning routine. And for me, it was the part that took the longest to develop. What I found the key was, it was stopping hitting the snooze button. And I've got three different ways that I help myself not hit the snooze. Ready? Let's go. Key number one to not hitting the snooze button was plugging my phone in across the bedroom on my dresser. This way I go to sleep faster at night because it's not next to my bed so I can't scroll. When I wake up in the middle of the night, I can't go grab my phone. And if I make it all the way to the phone alarm clock, I have to get up and go cut it off. Key number two to me stopping the snooze was investing in a sunrise alarm clock. Now I've shown this in some of my other videos and I've written about it several times, but this is an alarm clock that starts, uh, that simulates the sun. It starts lighting up in increments of brightness 30 minutes before your alarm is set to go off. And then it has natural, like you can choose different noises. Mine is birds, but they have a ton of different choices um, for what the actual alarm can sound like so that you wake up more naturally. This is especially important if you, like me, during the winter have to wake up well before the sun comes up. Before we get to the third thing, I have a question for you. Are you a hot or cold drink in the morning kind of person? I personally drink iced coffee year round. Doesn't matter if it's summer, fall, winter, spring. I always have iced coffee. Tell me in the comments below, are you a hot or a cold iced beverage person in the morning? Now, I know you're going, Beth, why are you asking me about that? Well, the last way that I trick myself into getting up in the morning and not hitting the snooze is by bribing myself. How you ask? Well, I have my drink ready to go. I have a Yeti. I put some fruit in there, some ice, some nice uh, water to get me going first thing and have that up on the counter. Now, if you're a hot person or a hot beverage person, not just a hot person, <laughs> Um, you can go ahead and have your coffee set to be ready to go. If you have one of the older coffee machines, that way you can smell that coffee. But bribing yourself to get up with a nice treat first thing in the morning is a great way to help yourself avoid hitting the snooze. And we're done. I really hope those three super easy, simple, and free, other than buying the alarm clock, ways to help you stop the snooze can help even the grumpiest person get up in the morning. Anything I talked about in the video is linked in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I'd love to know what you thought by either hitting the like or dislike button or commenting below and letting me know one of the tips that or tricks that maybe you have decided you're going to try and implement. Make sure that you hit subscribe so that you can get our two minute tips that are out every single Tuesday. Um, for more ways to help make your life simpler and more efficient. If you like what you saw and you're not ready to be done with me yet, that's awesome. There's lots of other ways we can connect. You can go to my website, www.sheetsandsystemswithbeth.com or find me on any of the social medias that I have linked below and we can continue to connect and I can continue to give you awesome ways to make your life simpler and more efficient. I hope you have a great day and I will see you on the flip side.